In this tutorial, we are going to learn about the log and key hypothesis and induced fit hypothesis. Log and key hypothesis. This hypothesis was proposed by M. L. Fisher. According to this hypothesis, the enzyme molecule has one or more specific sites or active sites. Here, the substrate fit into the active sites of the enzyme as a key fit into the lock. Here, Emil Fisher explained that the key as a substrate molecule and lock as the enzyme molecule. When key fits into the lock, it is lock key complex, which means enzyme substrate complex. Simply here, the substrate molecule binds at the active site of the enzyme molecule and forms the enzyme substrate complex. The substrate fits into the enzyme the way key fits into the lock. Second is induced fit hypothesis. This theory was proposed by Koshland 1962. According to this theory, active site is very flexible. The enzyme which contains active site is flexible, which means when the substrate molecule combines to the enzyme molecule, the active site is flexible, which changes the shape according to the substrate molecule. This development of attraction enzyme and substrate forms enzyme substrate complex. On the screen you can see the image of the substrate and the enzyme with the active site which does not have the appropriate shape to fit the substrate into it. But when the substrate molecule attaches to the enzyme molecule, the active size which is flexible changes its shape according to the substrate molecule to fit the substrate molecule into the enzyme molecule and it forms the enzyme substrate complex. Hope you found this video helpful then do like share and subscribe to the channel for further tutorials to watch the lock and key hypothesis and induced fit hypothesis in Hindi click on the i button given above of the video.